Daddy's back, you bitches! Hello, uh, Daddy's oh, back, you bitches! Dave, come on. Daryl, come on. Oh, Amigo, what are you doing? Dave is not coming. Uh, ignore him. Come on, we got to get this thing ready before we talk. Let's go. Here, pass me that. You ever been? No. Crazy place, Nico. <laughs> what you going to do? I might come back on board, or I might try to make a go of it. Like they say, it is the land of opportunity. I always wanted to make it big, on a nice place, get a dog, a house, live the dream. Like my cousin. Oh, yeah? Yes, he's got the love. Cows, women, cars, parties. Uh, he writes me in these wild emails. And after I got into trouble, I thought maybe... Uh, then I got this gig and I spent the next seven months with you fine people and I forget. After the war finished, I couldn't get a job. Nobody could. Uh, so I uh, did some dumb things, got involved with some idiots. Ah, we all do dumb things. That's what makes us human. Could be. Fuck you, 
can stand whole beach. Everyone likes us, Tusk. Nico, you ever had two women at once? Four big titties to be playing with? Mr. Sam, that chiumnati, he'll teach you your life, Chovice. This is the mansion? <laughs> Just a temporary place. The mansion is coming, cousin. That's the dream. Follow me. <laughs> come in, come in. Make yourself at home. What's mine is yours. Got him! <laughs> Little bastard, if he paid some rent, I wouldn't care. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, that's not nice. Ah, oh, cousin. It's so good to see you. <laughs> oh, oh. oh, shit. Oh, I need to change anyway. <sighs> so. So. So, so you full of crap or what? What? Uh, where's luxury condo? Where's sports car? Where's Barbara with big titties and Stephanie who sucks like a vacuum? What are you talking about? In your letters to my mother, in your letters to me, all I hear about is Mr. Big, Mr. Roman, living the American dream. Sports cars, condos, women, money, the beach. Opportunity. I come here, and the only thing big about your life is the cockroaches. <laughs> That's right. I got the best cockroaches. I got the best pets. <laughs> Screw you, you idiot. <laughs> okay, I'm an idiot, but you must admit, I have the best line in bullshit you ever heard. Yeah, this I know, asshole. But here. <sighs> All I needed was one good guy. One good guy I could do well. Not... Take over the world, but uh, do okay. Now maybe I have this. But what about you? What about you, cousin? What? What about me? Uh, why you live home after all this time? First I hear you are uh, running with the wrong kind. Then I hear you join the merchant navy. Now you're here. You never tell me anything. <laughs> no. What do you mean, no? No, I never tell you anything. Another time. Ooh, mystery man. Strange and exotic sailor. What happened? Did your captain make you pregnant? <laughs> Screw you. <laughs> no, no, it's nothing like that. The ships were fine. It was before that. Two things. You remember, during the war, we did some bad things. And bad things happened to us. <laughs> war is where the young and stupid are tricked by the old and the bitter into killing each other. I was very young and very angry. Maybe that is no excuse. Roman? Roman! Ah! Are you sleeping, you fat no, fuck? No Come on! What's the time? Shit, I've got to get the cab back. It's on the shift. <laughs> ah! Oh, Jesus! This like a rat shot in it! Nico, he... I've got to run. Uh, come well, meet me at the cab office. It's easy. Out about? the door, turn left, then the first I left of the diner, go down I'm one block and turn right on Iroquois. Then walk all the way down and we're right there on the left on the corner of Cisco about, Street. Man. It's really flash. We got lots of TDs and some incredible motors. Uh, Nico, give me a hug. Good to have you here, cousin. I've got something for you. Oh, damn. Damn, damn, damn. Uh, yes, Vlad. Uh, sorry. But forgive me, okay? No, no, please don't cut my cock off. Eh? Okay, okay, but yes. No. Uh, okay.
Come on, big guy, either do some work or get out of here. We don't need jokers. Screw you! Screw you! Baby, when I look into your eyes, it means something. I see little Romans, I see little Mallorys, I see stars, I see angels. In my homeland, we have a saying. Yeah, we got one too. You're a fag! <laughs> <laughs> Jesus, Roman, you fucking idiota! How can I take you seriously? Very difficult, I think. <laughs> Hello, Roman. <laughs> Hello, <laughs> <Miss>. <laughs> This is my cousin I tell you about, Nico. Hi. Nico, this is Mallory, the beautiful girl I tell you about. See? Not everything I tell you is bullshit. I bet most of it was. Hey. I hope you're less full of shit than your cousin over here. Ah. <laughs> Thank you. This is the woman that I'm going to marry. <laughs> Whatever you say. I thought you were going to marry me, <laughs> baby. Hey, but... Uh, great. Uh, you're fucking crazy, man. <laughs> you should lose few pounds. Otherwise, this beautiful lady is going to leave you. I know. I'm a fat prick. What did I do? Pay you yeah. debts? I will, I will do, man. We spoke of this. No, we didn't speak. You spoke. Then you say your phone out of batteries. You treat me like a bitch. Never. I treat you like an idiot, not a bitch, huh? <laughs> I guess it's true. The beautiful woman do like the guys with a funny sense of mm -hmm. humor. Ho, <laughs> ho. I'm laughing. <laughs> I'll get you the money. I know. And Roman, tell this fucking yokel here, if he doesn't stop staring at me, I'll have his head chopped up and put a film of it on the internet! Ouch. Ah. Oh, good. Great. <laughs> yeah. Fantastic. <laughs> Look, say what you like, but at least that guy knows how to speak to a lady. Yes, he's all charm. Uh, come on, Nico, let's go. Uh, darling, I, uh, I'll see you later. I've got to take my cousin around some more. Get him settled. Nico, you're driving us to a hardware store on Dillon Street. Doing some home improvements, wrong. You're going to build this mansion you tell me about? <laughs> oh, funny guy. We're going to get money. In America, you need money to do anything. You're taking me to a backroom game where I'll win all the dollars we need to really see this town. Nightclubs, women, titties! You can play, right? DC Dober, Uovo Igri? I am the best. I kick all the asses that play me. They call me the janitor. Because you can't pay your debts and they make you mop the floor? Never or what, no. Honey, <laughs> no. I'm the janitor because I always clean up. I always win. Get it? She starts up. I seriously hope your cards are better than your nicknames. Nico, wait for me here while I go inside to clean up. Oh, shit, uh, I almost forgot. I'm giving you my old phone. My new number's in there. Call me if some Albanians show up in some shitty page willard. Those are the guys I owe money to. Do, do not hurt them. I know what you're like, Nico Bellic. You and your debts, Roman. Ove kisto, Nika Drugacie.
so quiet out here, Roman. You winning? Molinte Red Sida. Don't worry, I'm getting so many bullets, it's like I'm an egg can. Roman, it looks like your money lending friends are here. Cousin, two guys are going in the store. I think they are the loan sharks you speak of. Shit, I'm down. You better get out of there. All right, all right, I'm coming. Shit, Nico, it's them. They must have been told I was here. Come back here, you shit! Remember, do not hurt the loan sharks. The debt will just increase. Get us back to the depot, quick! Damn! <laughs> Alright guys, now lose this. Sadani e taco tesco. Just like the old days, eh? In the old days we were dodging bombs, not lawn sharks. Just drive, leave the funny comments to me! Perfect. That is the last we've seen of those long sharks. I hope. We're here. Oh, you like your phone? Maybe one day you get a premium quality one like mine. Then you will have really made it. I can only wish. See you later, cousin. Man, Daddy, what's your problem? I don't have problem. You do. Don't be a dick, man. Come on. Where's your Russian friend now, huh? Eh? Not my friend. He's eh? my one shark. Eh? Stop this. Eh? What are you? Who are you? Get out of here. What? Yes. My arm. Oh. What about you? Help me. Help me. Come on, you fuck. Let her. Help me. Get out of here now. And if you come back, I'll kill you. You understand? You forgot this? You have been in tricks? Sonia. Shit, Nico. What did you do? He was going to stab me. Now he's going to kill you. Fuck him. Look at this mess. Screwed. Again. You want to know why I'm not <sighs> living in a nice condo, banging for women? It's because of shit like this. Assholes. Threaten Shut me. up. Oh, great. Mallory. Hey, beautiful. <laughs> uh, yeah, great. <laughs> uh, 
Listen, I, I'm having a bit of a problem at the office. Um, I can't do it. Nico can do it. Huh? And um, what? Well, why would you want me then? Well, screw you then. Great girl. Can you do me a favor? Mallory uh, needs a lift. Uh, can you go pick her up at the Hog Beach subway station? Yeah. Take the cab. She's got a friend with her. Maybe someone you can date. Fuck you. Oh, man, look at this crap. My computer and everything. Get in, ladies. Hey, Nico. Thanks for coming. I should have known Roman would find some excuse not to turn up. This is Michelle. Hi. How are you? My place is over on Mohawk Avenue. How are you finding America, Nico? Not exactly what I expected. Nico, you know what? You need someone to show you a good time. Michelle, how about you? Mallory, stop it! Come on, you guys. You're both single. You're adults. Take a number, Nico. Hey, I'd like to see you again, Nico. You look like that kind of guy I want to get to know. You look like you just jumped off the boat, Nico. Handsome man like you should get some new dress. I think he looks fine the way he is. I don't think he even changed out of those things on the journey. How are you going to impress a classy girl like Michelle? I'm easily impressed. I know you are, sweetie. <laughs> and I just don't get it. Thanks for the lift, Nico. Yeah. Thanks. Give me a call sometime. See you soon, Michelle. Cousin, I dropped the girls off. The friend gave me her number, but I don't think Mallory likes my clothes so much. I know just the place for you. It's on Mohawk and Home. Go and get something a bit more 21st century. Michael Graves is at it again. He voted to raise taxes to pay for free condoms in schools. He's against abstinence and pro underage sex. In 1968. Oh, no, no. Hey, Roman, I got some clothes. It looks like they brought the stuff in from the old country, though. We will take what we get. When the big money rolls in, then we will look real classy. Anyway, you have Michelle, classy girl for your arms. You should definitely keep dating her. <laughs> 